Hey Aquarius, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to my channel. This reading is going to be for my Aquarius viewers, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. As always, you guys, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. If this reading doesn't resonate for you, check out your other placements. The only other sign I have left to upload is Pisces. All the other signs is already uploaded. And if you're an Aquarius who is currently separated from your love interest, if it's no contact, if you guys are on a break or just recently broken up, I also do have love readings, you guys. For the ones who are separated, I will be doing for the ones who are involved soon enough. Um, probably after I do Pisces. But yeah, this is going to be for my Aquarius. You can also book your personal reading through the link in my description box, which is my website, you guys. On my website, I have a reading similar to the one I'm going to do for you. It's called Monthly Reading for Love and Finances. This reading, I'm going to do general finances and love. Um... The general will be like a what you need to know reading, which is on my website if you would like to book. But I do have a monthly reading of love and finances, a monthly prediction reading. And I also have a new uh, program going on on my site, a loyalty program. So when you go on my site, you guys, make sure you sign up to become a member. You know, it's email and password. Sign up to become a member because each service or product you book will accumulate points that you can redeem for rewards or, you know, like coupons, money off, percentages off. So each product you purchase, each um, service you purchase, it will accumulate points. If you've been booking anything within the past two to three months, nine times out of ten, you have points sitting. Even if you didn't make an account, you still have points sitting under the email that you booked your service or purchased your product with. Um, so just create an account on my website with that same email and um, you'll see like a my profile type of thing on that little tab section. It will be um, how many points you have and how you can redeem it. So definitely make sure you check that out, you guys. I'll be trying to do things to make readings more affordable. My readings aren't expensive anyways. Like it's a lot of readers who tax more than me. My readings are pretty affordable. So definitely make sure you check that out. I try to make it affordable and I try to, you know, do different deals and things to make it more affordable. Alrighty, so Aquarius, what can you expect from October? Let's see, what can my Aquarius viewers expect in October? A lot of communication, a lot of open heart communication, a lot of um, communication with a fire sign, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, or a Scorpio. It doesn't have to be those signs, but I just see a lot of open communication, especially with someone who you feel like things ended with. So it could be a friend that you fell out with and you thought you guys would never rekindle the friendship. You will be communicating with this person. It could be a family member that, you know, y'all argued and y'all cut each other off. And now there's communication in October. It's communication with someone who you cut off or they cut you off. And you thought things would be permanently done between you two. The color red is significant here. This person could have like, you know, red hair. They could have like rosy red cheeks, red nails, something like that. Or their favorite color could be red. But yeah, this is definitely somebody that you haven't spoke to in a while. Earth sign energy here as well. Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. This is definitely somebody that you haven't spoke to in a while. Um, it's communication happening here. Who is this person? How will my viewers know who this person is? Like, tell me more about it. Is it a friend? Is it a lover? Is it a family member? Like, who is this person? Somebody where you thought you guys were building a great bond. It's still not stating if this is romantic, platonic, or familial, but it is stating, um, Somebody that you thought you were making a great bond with, someone that you thought you could create a life with, you know, like a lifetime partner, even if it isn't romantic, a lifetime friendship, you know, um, having a friendship with a family member that lasts a lifetime. Like it's sort of like you expected things to just continue growing with this person, but it didn't. We have Libra energy here as well. For some of y'all, this could have resulted in like a court case or something, a lawsuit, a court case. Somebody might have used you for money with all these pentacles here. This person could have used you for money and you cut them off because they used you. They stole from you or they finessed you or they used you or they didn't pay you back. Something like that. The initials I'm seeing is T-L. I S A. I'm getting D too, D as in dog. This person could have a dog too, or you could be the one with the dog. That's a lot of animals in these cards right now. 
Yeah, basically, I see you making up with this person. I see they do have genuine intentions. They really do care about you. So whatever issue happened in the past, you know, it's up to you if you want to forgive them. It's up to you if you want to give them a second chance. You don't have to, you know, you don't have to. You don't. You have free will. You can do whatever the fuck you please. <laughs> but I do see um, if you're wondering if this person is being genuine or not, they are. If that is what would make your decision if that's like the final thing to make your decision on whether they're being genuine or not they are being genuine they are let's see what's going on with your finances what can you expect from your finances in october what can you expect from your finances in october See you giving money. Don't be giving no money to nobody this <laughs> That sounded so chaotic, but I don't give a fuck. Don't be giving no money to nobody this month. Whatever sob story this person is creating, it's a fucking lie. Whatever excuse they're creating, it's a fucking lie. Whatever promise they're making, oh, I'll pay you back, it's a fucking lie. For some of y'all, if somebody asking you to bond them out, keep their ass in there. Don't bond them out. I don't give a fuck who this person is to you. Don't bond them out because they deserve to be sitting. I'm not even going to lie to you. I'm not even going to lie. They did some foul shit, some toxic shit, some chaotic ass shit that they got to sit with their thoughts. They got to sit and self-reflect with what the fuck they did. They'll get bonded out eventually, but don't be the one to do it. Whether it's promised to appear or somebody else bonds them out, um, they will they will get out eventually. But mm -mm, don't, don't, mm mm. Don't give nobody no money, especially an earth sign, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. We literally have the devil card, Capricorn energy, the hermit, Virgo energy. And then we have the six of pentacles, earth sign energy in general, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. It's somebody that's going to be begging you for some fucking money. And if they can't get to you, if they can't reach out to you, they're going to have a friend or a family member beg you for that money for them. But this person, like, tell me more about this. Tell me more. Tell me more. Tell me more about this. This person, bro, I'm telling you, uh-uh. They fucked up their own life. And, like, this is the type of person that will sit there and do some fucking chaotic, reckless-ass shit and then blame the people around them. Like, even if you were... Let's say it is somebody that got locked up and they need you to bond them out. If you were to bond them out, they wouldn't even be appreciative. Like, they will look at you and be like, thanks. But then down the line, you'll realize they are not appreciative at all. They will, like... Oh, well, I didn't tell you to do that. Or, yeah, I told you to do that, but you didn't have to if you didn't want to. You know, nobody put a gun to your head and told you to do it. Like, I just see this person is real nasty and disrespectful. As soon as they get what they want, it's like a light switch. Like, they don't give a fuck about nothing no more. Mm -mm. Sagittarius energy here, too. Mm -mm. I'm not liking this. For some of y'all, you feel so tied to this person. This could be somebody that you romantically dealt with. Don't give no money to nobody this month. I don't give a fuck who it is, y'all. Do not lend nobody no money this month at least. If you decide on November 1st at fucking 12.01 in the morning, you're going to give this person money, then you do that. But in October, I don't know what the fuck it is about October. Please do not do it to yourself. Please don't. Please don't. And we're going to end that off there. Uh uh. Somebody is fucking manipulative, conniving. They're an opportunist. They will take that money and then treat you like shit directly after. Mm mm. Mm mm. What can my um Aquarius expect from their love life? I'm gonna do in September, actually. I mean, not September. Whoa. In November. Your love life. I'm gonna do it in November. What's going to happen within your love life? Because October is near, near to ending. Very close to ending. So let's see. My Aquarius viewers, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. What can they expect from their love life in November? November 2024. What can they expect from their love life? Oh, 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 oh. If you're dealing with somebody... Currently, you're romantically or sexually involved with someone. They have someone else in the picture. They are dealing with someone else. They are. They are. We have third party is involved. And then we have selfish, self-absorbed slash egotistical. So even if you aren't currently dealing with anyone, 
um you know if somebody comes towards you in november wanting to pursue you and you end up catching feelings or you end up you know letting them court you or you court them whatever the case may be um they have someone else in the picture don't believe this person when they say you're the only one don't believe them when they say you're the only one they're having sex with you're the only one that they talk to they're dealing with there it's not it's not they have a tendency of being in a makeup to break up type of connection and i see in november they're going to be reconciling with this their third party so when they meet you or currently in october if this is somebody that you're dealing with currently in october if this is somebody new when they meet you they're not going to be dealing with that person they will be 110 percent single but like i said this is a makeup to break up type of connection so in november it could be the beginning of november towards the middle or ending of november sometime in november they will be reconciling with this third party and yeah literally at the bottom of the deck entertaining others other options giving attention to others mm -mm. i'm gonna get more information on this um but it will be uploaded for my vip members so my vip members if you would like to um watch this video click the membership tab and just scroll um if you'd like to become a vip member you can do so by clicking the link in my description box or you can click the join tab on my channel it is $6.99 to $9.99 monthly to become a vip member you guys for $2.99 that's only the badge so when you comment on a video you know you'll have a badge next to your name and you'll be a a ethereal vibes member like that's how people will know but $6.99 is where you'll get all the exclusive videos all exclusive content first dibs on deals sales products and things like that and then the $9.99 is for live stream so I will be live streaming on that membership I will be doing free readings on there I will be doing paid personal readings on there I would I will be doing live stream you know readings on there um so definitely make sure you check that out it is $9.99 monthly and I will be doing multiple free readings on that membership tier level whatever you want to call it but it's $6.99 or $9.99 monthly to have access to the um, additional videos so definitely make sure you check that out you guys but yeah I'm gonna finish this reading for my VIP members thank you for watching you guys thank you for supporting hit that like button subscribe if you haven't already once again if you'd like to book your personal reading you can do so through the link in my description box which is my website you guys um but this is the end of the reading have a great day great night whenever you see this bye you guys